Anybody who's ever seen the inside of my bedroom can tell you that I am a slob. There is no order in there. I was moving stuff around to get my lamp and I find piles of change uh, everywhere. I must have 10, 15 dollars of change just lying around. But there are a few areas of my life that are dictated by order. Not a lot, actually very few. I ride the bus every day to work, just to work actually, where else? Some groceries, I guess. Riding the bus for groceries sucks. The bus. So I ride the bus every day. Except for the days that I'm too lazy to leave the house. Those are the best days. And when I get onto the bus, there's a very complex algorithm that I don't even understand on which seats I can and can't sit on. At a quick glance, you can see which seats I can and can't sit in. Anything marked with a red I can't sit in. My favorite seats are the ones right here at the front. You can see the road, you can comment on, you know, bad drivers, you can get to see who's coming in. If there are people sitting in the front, then I like to sit at the back here. You get a better view of what everyone on the bus is doing. Now the back seats here, you'd think you get an even better view. No, it's not as comfortable. The ride's weird. It's just, it's weird. Uh, not as good. I don't get it, and it has a lot, like if there are people sitting in certain places, it's, it's complicated. Riding the bus with me sucks. For everyone else but me, I have a great time. Another thing that's weirdly organized is my pockets. My left pocket is, is reserved solely for my cell phone, nothing else. My right pocket is reserved for keys and change. My coat, my front left is for my headphones, my front right is for my wallet. I don't like it in my back pocket. A couple times I've carried scissors in there. No one, no one carries scissors in their front pocket of their coat. Why do you have scissors in your coat? Oftentimes at family dinners, uh, my family will comment on how I'm only ever eating one food at a time. So stuffing first, because <laughs> we're always eating stuffing. So I'll eat usually the part of the meal that I'm the least excited about. Usually that's the vegetables. Always that's the vegetables. The meat is my favorite part but I eat it last. And so usually by the time I eat it, it's cold and not as good as if I would eat, have eaten it first. And I'm usually full and it's not as enjoyable, but that's the order. That's what it has to be. If I'm at a restaurant and it comes, my meal comes with fries and I finish the fries. I've, tr I've tried to get myself to start eating the main course of the meal first, but then I'm just not excited about the fries and fries are great, but they ruin the rest of my meal. Thanks, fries! Sometimes I just count things. If ever I'm reading a book, I'll count how many pages I have left until the next chapter. Or if I'm reading reports, I'll count how many reports I have left until I'm done. Sometimes when my dog is pooping, I'll count how many poops come out. Which is weird, no one should count their dog's poops. It's usually three. Depends how much he ate. Now I'm all mad about french fries.